In Retro Game of the Week, we dive into our game library and pick out a classic to see if it still holds up today. Let's grab a controller and play some Retro, Retro, Retro Games! Ho! With the release of Grand Theft Auto V just around the corner, we thought it would be a good idea to see how the open world saga started with the original GTA. This PC game from 1997 allowed you to take on the role of a criminal who could roam freely around a big city. The amount of violence and level of freedom GTA offered was truly groundbreaking back in the day. The fact that you could kill policemen and steal cars raised a lot of eyebrows. It gave the series the questionable reputation it still has today. GTA looked extremely primitive when it came out. The top-down view and lack of mini-map made it hard to navigate the city. But that didn't really matter since playing GTA was just a whole lot of fun. You could steal any car you fancied and then speed off to commit various crimes or just mess around. The goal was not to progress your way through a story, but rather to score enough points to open up the next section of the game. You earn points by successfully completing missions and doing side quests, but simply causing chaos would also get you much needed points. GTA contained all three cities that have gone on to be more fully realized in later games. You began in Liberty City, made your way to San Andreas, and eventually ended up in Vice City. Each city was made up of districts scattered with bomb shops, pay and sprays, police stations, train stations and more. The music was another great thing about GTA. Back then being able to get in a car and listen to different radio stations was truly something new and exciting. The radio stations still play a big role in the current GTA games. GTA's early sandbox freedoms and over-the-top violence easily made the dated graphics acceptable and it became that much more exciting to play since every adult in the world feared what GTA represented. Do you have fond memories of playing the older games in the GTA series? Which one was the first one that you played and what stood out about it? Let us know in the comments below.